Another excellent example of why we love the Champagne Club, uh, this is a micro grower producer. Wow. What a beautiful label too. I, I think that one just really stood out to me. Just how how different Timeless. it looks. Timeless? Yeah, yeah, but really gorgeous. So um, what I think is so interesting about this wine, and I remember tasting it with you, is that it's high percentage of Meunier. Indeed. So our three main grapes of Champagne, we have our Chardonnay, our Pinot Noir, and our Meunier. Right, Miller's Pinot because it's got this dusty uh, mm. Miller, like a like a uh, flower Miller, right? Uh -huh. um, so yeah, it's got a dusty appearance. It's a grape that's more widely found in the Valley de la Marne, where I believe this micro winery is. Is it? It is. So uh, <laughs> and the area really uh, a little more akin to uh, red grapes, right? Pinot right, Noir right. and, and what's what's great about Meunier? <laughs> is its late ripening ability so it does it does well in the cooler Marne Valley. Um yeah oh look at that there's nice, a little color intensity nice copper color in there huh? richness I do recall vividly uh this champagne it's ideal with like the main courses with like oh, later yeah. in the meal <clears throat> also to carry it through desserts. This is a lovely kind of richer <clears throat> when you have things mm. like foie gras you have a thin sliced steak like tagliata or maybe like a chimichurri like Argentinian. It has a, mm. what a really striking about this, again, and it did when I first tasted it, it has a real red fruit component to it. Yes. Red apple skins, like cherry and cherry blossom. So I get where, you're, where your head's at with like red meat. I think this has so much complexity and a little bit of that like dusty, like leather bound book, you know, wisdom to it. I love that. It's love beautiful. that. I get a little bit on the finish, a little bit of like dried um, peach gummy rings, yeah. a little bit of, but quite all really well composed and I delicious. Could, I could drink this throughout the entire meal, but I love the idea of it with your main course. Love it, Thanks for our friend, uh, Garth Hogdon, who brought it on board. Cheers. Cheers.